I'm Sarah Costa and this is your news brief. We're still waiting for police to identify the 34 year old suspect killed after being shot by officers during a confrontation following a theft of a vehicle and major crash on the south side. Police Chief William McManus said there was a call for a stolen vehicle in the 200 block of Candalia Avenue last night. They eventually found the suspect but had to chase him down. That suspect crashed on the corner of Theo Avenue and Flora Street. Police say the man had a gun on him when they caught up to him. Four officers ended up shooting at him. The man died at the scene. All four officers will be placed on administrative duty pending the outcome of the investigation. It's a case of whose laundry is it? Good morning, I'm Katrina Weber on the south side. That question, it's the police coming out here to this laundromat here at the corner of West South Cross and Zarzamora. The police tell us that the call that they got at around five o'clock this morning came out as a robbery. Someone robbed at knife point of their laundry. They sorted it out. They've talked to people at the laundry and realized that it was more of a disturbance. Two groups of people fighting over who owns a basket of laundry. And during that fight, someone did pull out a knife. Police took that man into custody. But what is really bizarre about this story is that that same man they say was involved in an incident just two weeks ago. We were at this very laundry where uh, pol police say that the driver knocked that man through the glass window. He was injured at that time. But this morning he was back here again, according to police and they do have him in custody in connection with what happened here this morning and also because he had an outstanding warrant. Reporting from the South Side, Katrina Weber, KSAT 12 News. That's all for now. You can find the latest headlines on our Facebook and Twitter pages.